in just a moment. In the meantime, I'm with Carrie Woodruff from Tosh, and we're going to be talking about uh, obesity, which has officially been declared a disease. Correct, by the American Medical Association. Right, and uh, I, I guess it's about time, right? Correct, yep. Yeah. yeah, because hopefully this will help to thwart more actions towards um, dealing with the issue. And so maybe more pharmaceutical development, more research, more um, paying for services such as nutrition services or other medical services. And even delve deeper into the education part of it. Exactly, correct. Right. Yeah. So, so what are the things uh, initially we can do now that it's been declared a disease? Yeah, so the hope is that insurance payers will now pay for services that help to deal with it. So like I said, you know, nutrition visits or medical visits. Um, physicians now can bill for their time, ideally, by being able to address obesity. Mm -hmm. um, we found that individuals who are, be, or who are obese, only about 50% um, of physicians address that with their patients. So if you're seeing this yeah. large population and only half of them are being addressed, um, you know, this concern, so it'll be good to increase um, services. So this is bound to uh, help us out as a country then, don't you think? That's the goal, yep. That is the goal. Uh, how's that been accepted here in Utah, or is it too early to tell? It's too early to tell. We're going to have to see what payers are going to do about it, and we're going to have to see what physicians and other healthcare care um, practitioners. So by the American Medical Association providing this diagnosis, it doesn't provide any policy reform in of itself, but um, because it the diagnosis... It toward could, that correct, direction, I guess. Correct, yeah. yeah. So we'll have to see what happens. All right. Well, Carrie, thank you very much for being with us. And uh, for more information, where, where's a good place to go for that? Um, you can look at Tasha's website um, through Intermountain Healthcare. So, yes. Okay. Well, thanks a lot. Appreciate you being with us. Okay.